Welcome to my lifestyle. I'm Ryan. Today we're talking about using romaine lettuce as a substitute for pita breads or wraps. Here is an example of what we'll be making today. It is the perfect shape and size to be a healthy delivery system. Romaine lettuce has a mild taste and contains lots of vitamins and minerals including B's, A, K, C and calcium. Most wraps and bread contain very little nutrition per calorie. I call these empty calories. Using lettuce instead of bread or wraps is a great way to eliminate those empty calories, especially if you're trying to lose weight. This is a great idea for people who are gluten intolerant, which means they can't eat wheat but still want to enjoy a wrap or sandwich. It's also great for people who are looking to save some calories, those who don't want to eat all the processed ingredients, sugars, and preservatives in breads and wraps, and for those who want to incorporate more produce into their diet. It is simple to do and your body will thank you. When shopping for lettuce, it's important to buy the whole head of romaine lettuce and not the bag of romaine hearts. The best leaves for the wraps are the big outer ones that do not come on the hearts. Once I use all the big outer leaves for wraps, I use the small inner ones for a salad. Inspect the leaves and buy the ones with the least amount of rips or holes in them. You don't want food to fall out of your wraps. For each of our examples today, I use four large romaine lettuce leaves per meal. It's much easier to hold and eat small wraps, so just put a little bit of each ingredient. The first use is for fajitas. Put your clean romaine lettuce leaf on a plate and add your favorite ingredients. It is best to put the ones that need to be spread on first. Our fajita has strips of chicken, but you can also use beef avocado or guacamole, tomato, salsa, cheese, onions, and bell peppers. I prefer salsa that does not contain preservatives or salts. Take the large end and fold it up just like you would a pita bread. Roll over the sides and start eating the small end first. It takes two hands to eat these bad boys. Tuna sandwich, more like tuna in a lettuce wrap. Here we have some canned tuna, though fresh also works fine. Cut it into small pieces and mix with chopped avocado, green onion, celery, and tomato. Stir aggressively so the avocado becomes a mush to make a somewhat doughy mixture. Click here to watch my video about five simple uses for avocado, one of which is a tuna sandwich. This perfect combo creates a great texture and flavor so you don't need mayonnaise or sauce. Just spoon a thin layer of it down the middle, wrap it up, and eat. The next use is for salmon. You can use any combination of veggies. This is just an example that I enjoy. If you use canned, it's very similar to tuna. Just chop everything up and mix together in a bowl. If you use fresh salmon, flake the fish and add veggies in strips, just like the fajitas. Ours has green onion, tomato, and cucumber. Our last example is for egg. It's very similar to the tuna. We mix onion, bell pepper, celery, avocado, and pepper with our hard-boiled eggs in a bowl. Just spoon a thin line of it down the middle of the lettuce leaf, wrap it up, and grab it with two hands to eat. These are just some of the ideas of how I use romaine lettuce as a substitute for bread and wraps, but the possibilities are endless. I hope you enjoyed these tips from my lifestyle to yours. And until next time, Stay fresh. Click here for more of my videos.